Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Lorian, I'm a mum of five and this is our meals for the week. So this day we had lamb chops, mash and some vegetables. I like like the mixed vegetables in the bag sometimes. I find like they're just really easy to put in the microwave for like a minute and you don't have to get like loads of pots and pans out. Curtis got half a lamb from someone he worked for actually for £65 I think so it was a really good price. She knows somebody who was selling them and yeah we got one and we still have loads of it left. The lamb chops were so nice and we normally have it with mint sauce. I absolutely love mint sauce it is so nice I like it with anything though I don't just like it with lamb I do like it with absolutely any meat So on this day we had meatballs, mashed potato, cauliflower cheese and then some spinach just because I needed to use it. If I've ever done meatballs before I've always done it in a pasta but on the packaging it said that you have them with like lingonberry jam and um, that's how they have it in Sweden and we'd never tried that before so we had it and it was really nice but actually I forgot to film the mash I don't know why I'm only just realising that now I probably like paused it while I was like doing other things and then forgot to put it back on but yeah it was really nice really liked the meatballs um, and I much prefer it like that rather than having them in a pasta. So this was our pasta with just some parmesan on top. So I bought a packet of um, like bacon and prosciutto or something for Rue and Flossie because the boys had McDonald's with my dad. He picked them up from school. Um, and me and Curtis had that pasta evangelists, which is so nice. It's quite expensive. We've tried it a few times and it's always really lovely pasta, but we've got it in like a flash sale. So we've had 50% off it and it is still quite expensive like that, but it's really nice. So this was Rue and Flossie's and then um, me and Curtis had ours a little bit later on. Yeah, and I think ours was mushroom with um and you put some you cook it in some butter we had some parmesan on top i know mushroom is a strange flavor absolutely love it my children really don't like mushroom but i really like it like i could eat mushrooms just as they are but curtis thinks that's really strange does anybody else do that or does everybody cook mushrooms because he just finds it so weird So some days Curtis doesn't work out and he works in his workshop because he's a joiner so he makes things like if he's got a job where he's building things like making someone's window or door, loads of different things he does but yeah usually he's making a window or a door or something in the workshop um, and sometimes we go out for lunch and we like to go to Waitrose and get their baguettes, they do like ready made baguettes um, and they make sandwiches near their fridge with their ready to go sandwiches they have like a basket stand with like sourdough baguettes sandwiches, they are amazing and we go and get them for lunch if he's working at home. We were really fill up after that he had lots of chocolates and biscuits and we got a costa coffee um so we just had we needed to choose some salmon so we just made a salmon salad and it was perfect really because we just really weren't very hungry and it was just really nice and very light and we had that with some balsamic dressing I wasn't sure what to do with our lamb neck 
um, fillet and I used it in a curry because somebody said they made a curry out of it. So um, this rice I got in a flash sale for a pound a pot. So I bought three of those just for an easy rice for a dinner. We all had this and we did a lamb curry. We put lots of different spices and stuff in the slow cooker with carrot and onion. We probably could have done with a bit more lamb. I mean, it's not a lot to spread between the six of us. And we went into Mark Spencer and got some naan bread. So Curtis doesn't like coriander. So I got a couple of plain ones. And then I got a couple of coriander and Horatio wanted to try the coconut ones because he loves coconut. So we tried one of those too. So this dinner is chicken legs, diced potatoes and green beans which are delicious. The diced potatoes you can either fry them, if you just chop your potatoes up into cubes with the skin on, you can just fry them like that in butter and put some herbs on or you can put them in the oven. I put them in the oven this time just because it's easier but I find they're really nice and really easy to do like that so yeah definitely try them if you haven't. It's a simple way of doing potatoes. Um, green beans, I always mix my vegetables in a little bit of butter and the chicken legs we got from the farm shop, we had these before and they are so nice. We're not fans of chicken legs really. Um, but these ones are so nice we got them for half price so it's five pounds for a packet of quite a few and yeah they're really nice So we had that on Sunday and we had that with an apple crumble. We all love apple crumble. The crumble topping is my favourite. I always double it so there's just so much like to the fruit. Double the recipe of the topping. And um, Me and Horatio love it. Um, so yeah, that was everything. We had that with some custard. So that's everything for my video everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for all your lovely messages always. Um, hopefully I will see you at my next video. And I hope you all have a really lovely rest of the week. <laughs>